हेलो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक वंस अगेन ऑनलाइन क्लासेस दिस इज एक गुप्ता योर इंग्लिश फैकल्टी आर्ट्स स्कूल बानसोर इन लास्ट वीडियो वी हैव स्टार्टेड द इंग्लिश रीडर लेसन नंबर थ्री द सुनामी एंड वी हैव कंप्लीटेड द फर्स्ट पार्ट इट्स गोइंग ऑन सेकेंड पार्ट वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अ सेकेंड पार्ट आई होप यू हैव गुड अंडरस्टैंड द फर्स्ट पार्ट इन ईजी वे और ईजिली सो कंटिन्यू विद मी ओके एंड Start studying the page number twenty-seven, part second, chapter number three, the tsunami. Now here is a story from Thailand. Now the next story is about the place is Thailand. The Smith family from South East England were celebrating Christmas at a beach resort in Southern Thailand. It's Smith Smith family. Smith family. Uh, they are Smith family from South East England. South East England. Okay, and they have gone. to celebrate their christmas festival uh, south, uh, southern england uh, thailand okay tilly smith was a 10 year old school girl uh, and her sister was a 7 year old their parents were penny and colin smith her parents name penny and colin smith colin was his father and penny was his mother okay now uh, the time was it was 26 december 2004 Okay, and deadly tsunami wave were already to their way, and their deadly means they were dangerous. Very dangerous wave of tsunami is on the way. They had been triggered by a massive earthquake of a northern, no, uh, northern Sumatra earlier that morning, and the tsunami has has come early in the morning as an earthquake. Okay, and there. Uh, here is the word meaning triggered. Triggered means I mean like uh, because when anything, anything has been stopped and suddenly it, it started. Or maybe the triggered means uh, the second meaning of the like a uh, cause means uh, any reason. The water was swelling and kept coming in. Penny some Smith remembered. So the water was swelling and kept coming in Smith. It's uh, proceeding. So Penny. Smith remembered one thing: the beach was getting smaller and smaller. I didn't know what was happening. Miss Penny noticed one thing: the uh, means the beach was getting smaller and smaller. How is it going to smaller? Because receding, receding. The water is receding. Yesterday I told receding means go back. Okay, water is go back, so beach will be short. Next, but Tilly Smith sensed that something was wrong. But Tilly. Till he had got something is wrong, which is going, which was going to, which was about to happen. Okay, her mind kept going back to a geography lesson she she had taken in England just two weeks before. She flew out to Thailand with her family. Okay, so man, means till he was, uh, it has been told that till he was nine year, ten year uh, school, ten year old school girl, and she. she used to study geography lesson so she remembered that uh, one day the uh, just that day the teacher had taught to tilly about the earthquake about the like a tsunami okay so she was remembering those things tilly saw the sea slowly rise slowly rise and it started to form start to form means it's getting to form to to show anything and here is a bubble Form verbful means like uh, verbful. Okay, she remembered that she had seen this is this in the class video of a tsunami that had hit the Hawaiian island in 1946. Means Tilly remembered those things that her teacher had taught her about the tsunami, and it was it was it had happened Hawaiian. That was the area in 1946. It had happened before. Okay, so it had happened. So she remembered, and her geography teacher had shown her class the video, the to and told them that tsunami can be caused by the earthquake, volcanoes, and landslides. Landslides means the lands come up and down and slips. Okay, slides. Second, volcanoes. Volcanoes means it's a very large and uh, very very like a uh, so dangerous uh, approximately 1000 degree celsius it can be more than hot okay and the first earthquake you know very well tell him 
started to scream at her family to get off the beach means tilly scolded her family uh, like screamed at her family what she want to tell she want to tell she wants to tell let's go from here because something is about something is wrong and something is going to be happen okay let's see next she talked about an earthquake under the sea she got more and more hysterical said her mother penny i didn't know what a tsunami was but seeing my daughter so frightened i thought something serious must be going on who told tilly's mother penny penny told if my daughter is screaming like this and um, uh, uh, so serious like this so we should listen to her something is wrong which uh, which is must be going on here okay which must be going on here so they understood and hysterical means when you are hysterical you shout laugh cry and wild excited way without any control over yourself means you have angry you don't have a uh, control yourself what you are talking what you are saying what you are doing and you become a hesitate you become hesitate so like that this is called hysteria next Kelly parents took her and her sister away from the beach to the swimming pool at the hotel. A number of other tourists also left the beach with them. Exactly. Kelly and Kelly parents understand what is going to about here, what is going to be happen here, and they make them understand. The whole people who were all there, like a tourist, they made them understand also. Let's go from here. Let's leave this place. Otherwise, anything can be happen here. Anything wrong can be happen here. Okay. So after some time, what happened? Then it was if it was as if the entire sea had come out after them. I was screaming then. Run. Okay. The finally took refuge in the third floor of the hotel. The building withstood the surge. Surge means force of momentum means. Okay, of three tsunami waves, if they had stayed on the beach, they would not have been alive. Means the tsunami waves hit approximately third floor of the hotel. So you can remember, you can think if it's a first floor, second floor, and third floor. So if tsunami's wave hit the third floor. If they stayed in the hotel, so definitely they would not have alive, right? Isn't it? The Smiths later met other tourists who had lost entire families. After some time, they met Smith and Smith's family. They met the some tourists who were stay there, and they lost their family. And they, when they met, so then they discussed what about the tsunami. Thanks to Tilly and her geography lesson, they had been forewarned. Tilly went back to her school in England and told her classmates her terrifying tale. And uh, so exactly, uh, Tilly father thank said thank to Tilly because you saved our lives and some tourists also. And thank to also uh, your uh, sorry geography lesson and your teacher who told me who told you that uh, how is the tsunami? What is uh, what is the cause of the tsunami? And uh, you and your geography lesson, your geography teacher had saved us. So. Here is a very sweet and interesting message for you that you should study everything with carefully because study will help you at every moment. Okay, I have seen that those people who have studied eight, ten, twelfth, and they are not able to fill the any form like a bank opening, a bank account opening form. Okay, and this type form they are not able to fill. But exactly, you will have to learn all these things. You will have to be prepared. You will have to understand those things. Which is near to you, which can be, which can be appear before you any time. Okay, so be aware for everything. For the next and third part, we will meet in the next video. Till then, thank you.